So, Eurovision, it's not good enough. And anybody who cares about Eurovision should say the same. I was just, I was waiting, because I didn't, I don't, I don't like watching any fucking quarterfinal, semi-final shit. For starters, I've not got the time, and I don't want it. I don't like it, I'm, gonna, I'm not interested. But it would just ruin the fucking final. I like watching the final going, oh, what's going to happen next? And I just knew this is going to be fucking shite. You're not going to get... The, the, and I saw uh, Lorene, Lorene was there. I was like, oh, even her song. Even her song, I was like... Sorry. It might have even been my favourite. I, I liked the Poland one, even though it was uh, it sounded like fucking solo. No, not just because it says solo, but it sounds like it reminded me of solo by Clean Bandit. It's not obviously the exact same, but it's too close. It kind of sounds like it, and it also fucking says solo, solo like that. And that was actually one of my favourites, just because it's sort of upbeat. And the uh, Lorene one. That's maybe my favourite in all seriousness. And that's no, that's no fucking saying much. I was like, just feel like there's nothing. Nothing else. And I, 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 said, I said to Daniel, me and Daniel were watching it. I said, oh, my favourite is... Um, song ever, Eurovision song, is uh, her song, a song that she did about 10 years ago called Euphoria, and I played it, played it back on my phone, and I was watching it, and I swear to God, I had a fucking, uh, I, maybe not a lump in my throat, or a fucking tear in my eye, but I love that song, I love the performance, I loved kind of what it was about, the song, Um, I love, I love things like that. I love the music. We're never going to see... We're never going to see its, uh, its likes again. We're never going to see its likes, its likes again. No for an hour... And I, and I, and I tweeted this. No for an hour, 25 years, 50 years. Man, man is skin. I don't know how you say that, but was class. I don't... I, I disagree. I disagree. It's not my type of music. It's not my type of music. Which song? The one I just fucking said. Quite a dog podcast. The one I just described. Euphoria by Loreen. How many times do I have to fucking say it? Euphoria by Loreen. Or Loreen. What one? Euphoria. What one? Euphoria. And what, 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 what one? Euphoria. Euphoria. Bad mood. Of course I'm in a fucking bad mood. They say to come on here and haven't to read shit like that. I'm just after saying, my favourite one's Euphoria by Loreen. What one's that? What song is it? Fucking hell, man. Saw your post on Twitter that you were betting on Poland uh, with Daniel. No, wasn't he? As I am probably the only Polish shareholder here, made me happy, warm, ubu, and the most, most importantly, cosy. I wasn't betting, first of all, I wasn't literally betting on Poland. Secondly, I wasn't like, Poland's going to win this. I was just saying what, what me and Daniel's favourite was with that. Right, first song, like when it kind of like recaps, first song, right, that's the favourite so far because it's the fucking first one. Second one, mm, maybe still the first one. And then we go to Poland, right, that's the favourite so far. Lorena's like, I'll stick with Poland. Wasn't he betting? I know you weren't, shut up. What? No, I thought you meant, I thought you got mixed up and you thought I was actually like, Poland's going to win this. Because a lot of people are like that here. You say that you a, a particular song was your favourite and people interpret that as meaning you're telling everybody that's going to win. Believe me. Um, no. No. That Eurovision. What, what was it? Who was it? Was it second last band? Second last one. They had the moustaches and all the sort of mad stuff there and they had some fucking annoying pish song. It, it, it represented 
one thing I, I, I don't like about sort of modern Eurovision maybe last f- fucking 10 years or something, it's just far too self-aware. I know it already got self-aware. I know I spoke about this on Friday. I know it already was a bit self-aware. But now it's just like, this is a daft song. This is a daft song. We're just going to have like mad stuff on the screen and everybody's going to be like, what's this all about? I just thought it's no... It's not good enough. It's not good enough. And the the, the the Finland one... By the way, I don't, I don't watch um, Eurovision with my face tripping me. The... Um, and what was it? Was it the Finland one that got the lots of uh, public votes? Bowl cut, then that sort of thing. Whatever it was. That as well. I don't know. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm expecting too much. I, I just like stuff to be a bit kind of uh, unintentionally. Like sort of cheesy, unintentionally, you know, kind of a bit cringy or cheesy or authentic. I don't like this whole, this is weird, isn't it? Or, I like, you know, dressing like that and then, then that we think, oh, the song's a bit, this is going to be really catchy, everybody's going to be there. I don't know. What, what am I after? Is it me? Perhaps it's me. The Edgar one was shit. I was delighted when the public vote just went like that. Nah, 12 points or something. I mean, you know, that one where you can get like 300 points. 12 points is the fucking maximum per like country. But I mean, um, Who the hell is Edgar? I thought, this fucking, I swear to God. That reassured me. See, when that got hardly any votes, with the, with, you know, the public vote, I was like, good, 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 good. We're still, we've not completely fucking lost the plot. Because I remember seeing people tweeting it, various people were tweeting it, oh, Edgar Allan Poe one and Poe, Poe, Poe and things like that. And then when it only got, like, hardly anybody voted for it, the public, I thought, good, we're getting somewhere. I mean, I'm no, I'm no like, oh, good, people have spent time trying to make something. Ha-ha, it didn't succeed. Ha-ha, I don't mean like that. I just, um, no. And anyway, so, so when, I, when I tweeted about that second last lot, was it Croatia? I said something, I uh, it's just... No, a lot of shite. Uh, somebody replied saying, uh, yes, uh, I something something creeps uh, with a, the far left propaganda. Something, something, something. Um, and I was like, is this a, is this a wind up? Is that a, is that a joke? Is that a kind of ironic thing? And I looked through their timeline. Um, so I blocked him. I, I, I screen grabbed it and then tweeted it and then, well, then I blocked him and then people kind of replied to that person and then I just left the conversation. And it, it reminded me of uh, certain taxi drivers that I, I would maybe speak to. Like you're getting on with a taxi driver for like 10 minutes and you're yapping away and taxi driver might go like that. So what did you get up to last night? Did you watch the game? No, I'm not really into football. Um, I wasn't out, like drinking after the game. I was didn't watch the game. I was watching Eurovision. All oh, right, any good? No, I didn't like. Oh, I saw that. I, I, I saw that fucking far left propaganda. You know what I mean? Creeps. I just let let this out here. Um, I no, I'm all right here. No, I just remembered my my, my pals at a pub. I just, I just, I'll just get out here. 